Welcome into this week's edition of Film Room Friday presented by Microsoft. The Jaguars travel to Miami to face a Dolphins defense that has had a hard time stopping the run. Let's jump into the tape. And Dalvin Cook makes him pay for putting six, only six in the box. You've got six blockers for six defenders. Kind of surprising when you're having a hard time stopping the run, you'd want to outnumber that six. Bring seven. And Dalvin Cook makes him pay. The Jaguars, though, I don't expect them to see six in the box. Seven or eight or even nine is more likely. And when you have a hard time stopping the run, your efforts are totally focused on stopping the run and play action can hurt you. Stephon Diggs sneaks out the back of the end zone and McCain, let's look at the corner. He is biting up on a run action away from him. He's so worried about stopping the run that Stephon Diggs is wide open. If the Jaguars can run the ball, play action will work. And the Hall of Famer Frank Gore is not gonna play the rest of the season. And in his place, Kalen Balazs. And boy, did he have a heck of a ball game against the Minnesota Vikings. The fourth round pick, look at his vision as he cuts back to the outside, reading the block of his tight end. And once he gets out into the open field, the acceleration and getting north-south, nice looking back. And he added a 75-yard run against the Vikings. Look at the vision once again. Off of the block of guard Jesse Davis, who is one of my favorite blockers in the National Football League, and accelerates. And that acceleration results in a 75-yard touchdown for the rookie, a back that the Jaguars better be aware of. And if the Jaguars can stop the Dolphins running game, Ryan Tannehill is a sitting target in the pocket. And the Dolphins have had issues with stunts. This is a stunt in the middle, a TT. You can see the defensive tackles collapsing the pocket, as well as the defensive ends. And Ryan Tannehill goes down. He was sacked nine times in this ball game. The one guy though that I love on their offensive line besides Jesse Davis, Left tackle, Laramie Tunsil, zero sacks allowed on the season. Should have been a pro bowler. 